thanks to Diego and Deesmaker and the MIT club for having me. It's really cool to teach another class here. My business is built on open source and a lot of businesses also too. Arduino is a mini computer that you can program. So it's about the size of a credit card. It's really easy to use and so lots of kids can program it. Next is a trimmer potentiometer. And so that's basically just a smaller version of a potentiometer. I think really we didn't get it. I, yeah. I... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we really don't know. We didn't really know what he was doing at the time. Here's one of the projects that I've made. It's called the FUD Spot. I've done the Fuzzbot, which is an Arduino-based robot platform that has an ultrasonic distance sensor, um, so it can detect if there's like a wall in front of it or a hand in front of it, and also has a Swiffer duster on the back, so it can dust around your house while avoiding the obstacles. So first is the USB. That's where you connect it to your computer. For his birthday, we went to uh, class and he started drawing this little crowd of all of the teachers and there's this little guy right in the middle and all these engineers standing around him and they're like, oh, that is so cool. You know, no one's ever done that before. Oh, you should sell that. Oh, we're like, wow, that's when we realized, oh, maybe he is doing something that is it has, unusual. That's unusual, and, yeah. yeah. So this is the gas cap. And so it's an LED hat that has a fart sensor. So this is the Altoids Mini Tin. Um, it has a XB, which is a wireless module, uh, a little switch and an LED, and the fart sensor. So when you fart into the little Altoids tin, then it displays how bad it was on the hat in methane concentrations. So batteries have a positive and a negative, and if you reverse it, it'll short circuit, or maybe it'll blow up, or maybe it'll heat up really hot. It's really good to make sure it's in the right way. Today we have Quinn uh, teaching an Arduino class. It got sold out a few weeks before the class, so uh, yeah, he's, he's very popular and very, uh, very in demand. So it should be something like a TTY dot USB modem. He's very good for a 12-year-old teacher, I think, and uh, he's probably better than some professors that I've had in terms of his ability to speak and convey information. Your Arduino Leonardo on... I want to be uh, like an educator and a UX designer, like a user experience. And then also I'd like to be an engineer, an uh, electrical engineer. While he does plenty of things that are not so kid-like, it's important to be a kid. It's important to mm -hmm. be 12, 13 now. Other things outside of electronics make him happy, so we, we love that.